There are many bizarre ritual spiritual beliefs which are deeply embedded within destiny. Oh yes, they've removed many of the ridiculous elements and replaced it with their own equally as ridiculous ideas. They're not old fashioned in their spirituality. They don't call it spirituality. They see things a bit differently, but even so, just because you change the words, it does not change the fact. The way in which destiny works is as a spiritual group. It's a religion steeped in certain mysticism, not as far out as much of the New Age in many ways, but in other ways further out altogether. I've known many New Agers who accept evolution and rationality, but think that energy and consciousness, these are things that science will get into and understand more of as time goes on. Whereas with destiny, they claim the universe or this matrix existence here on Earth was created by reptilians, by the reptilian god Anu. They claim that they could have contact with dimensional beings. And to put the icing on the cake, Bernard Pullman claims he deleted that. They claim there was this process of reincarnation because people were so ill-developed and so stuck in belief systems, these constructs and the matrix reality which goes beyond the physical into the dimensions. People would go over there and be forced to reincarnate, come back to Earth and keep the process going. And then they changed their mind because Bernard deleted heaven. And now, according to Bernard, when you die, you just die. Unless you're a Destonian. Oh yes, because if you're a Destonian, a developed Destonian, you will go on. Layers and layers of mystical bullshit.